233, uh, disturbance at 1215 North Milwaukee at the Burger King. You know, a male is rolling his marijuana inside the store. I guess he has been banned back to leave, but the caller is not leaving. He's wearing a brown hat, green jacket, gray sweatpants, and black shoes. In the principal's office, the teacher says the car, his car was taken by a student. Um, it's all on camera. It's a blue Sonata was taken. Plate of Queen 809-699. Queen 809-699.
Uh, as well. Okay, thank you. Send back. Slow it down for 25, zone 12. Is that in the front or the back? Kinsey, there's 85 people have the dogs off the leash, parked 5 by 1, and they were told to stop, but they get combative, per the anonymous. Charlie, one two one eight five five, one two one eight five five, or even just one zero eight nine nine, one zero eight nine nine. Property in progress, 76, I'm sorry, 726 North Ridgeway, 726 North Ridgeway, uh, for a male black tearing down fences wearing black clothing. And then we got a second call, 626 North Ridgeway, uh, for the same male breaking out windows. Here's the city citywide battery in progress, 11814 South Eggleston, intoxicated, known female hitting the caller, refusing to leave, 5th District, so not. She won't answer any of the call takers' questions. She won't provide any details, but she's by Kilborn and Wayman. 
And her earlier calls to 911 gave a location of 4701 West West End. You want to come next? 1712, can you show us going to 17 with one? 104, 1736 at the time. Yeah, the security company called it in. Pretty big building. Uh, we walked around it. Doesn't look secure. Doesn't look like anyone's here. Just making sure. Uh, uh, it's, 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 it's showing on the ticket where the alarm's at and where it triggers. Just an audible panic alarm.
has been tinted. Make sure you stay vigilant and alert, especially on lunches. Guys, watch out for each other. Moving on to first shot event. We were in the station on 1840 Springfield. It should be under 1840 Springfield. The RD number is at 5007. Uh, it's for our event. You're in need of 041 Adam for the first shot. Okay, so the one that is on the first shot, you want the one from 1840 South Springfield. So you went in, you went in from that stop, right? Uh, on paper. 472 hour. The one arrest, uh, they changed 20. Alright, 1722. Was the car recovered already and it just hasn't cleared the hot desk? Is that what they're saying? Well, they wouldn't, they wouldn't uh, talk to me at all. They just, you guys had to call them. It was recovered and processed prior to the day. The people that processed it did not take it off the hot file, so it's just taken off. Maybe you can take it off the hot file. Okay, so far. So, uh, would you be able to do that for us? We can't do it. We're going to uh, check with the city wide. If they can contact the hot desk, somebody wants to. Of course. 1423. 1423. Well, can you please show us on lunch at 3251 West North Avenue? 3251 North Avenue, it's for enjoy.
Get us at 30 City Wide. We got a ticket of a person with a gun, Marquette and Evans. Evans and Marquette. Call us these two male blacks, both black coats, red hoodies, with backpacks. Both have guns, uh, and they're standing on the corner. They got the guns out, it says. Both have guns out and standing on the corner. Third District Zone 7. One seven, one seven. Man, plan mobile with the dust, please. Seven two zero two for the uh, mobile. Disturbance in the ER room. They are got a male that's under the influence. He's in his late twenties, being combative in the ER at the region. Five three zero seven eight zero six eight zero one four.
Guadalupe called it in. Caller stated that her mother-in-law left the scene. Her name is Bertha Cruz, 40 years old, wearing a black coat, blue leggings, carrying a gray purse. She was driving a blue Toyota Caravan, I guess. Mother took the complainant's belongings. No further. Okay. 431. 431. Five, that's Swedish. Uh, we're going to be shutting off our cameras. 10-4. 4011 West 5th. Caller says there's a female black in the alley taking off her clothes and lying on the ice. No weapon seen. Are you safety trained? Behind the building, heavy set female white and a skinny female Hispanic and an unknown third party intentionally turned the lights out. Zero two three is clear. Two, two zero two three ten four.
Oh, wait, step by. I think I put her as a male instead of a female. Okay, yeah, she's Clara Ballard out of 1311 North Hofstede. Um, she's good. First one, thank you very much. You're welcome. Well. Sure, one one five two eight. One one five two eight. Ten thirteen. Hello. Stack, wait, stack out. Nine and on citywide, one ticket of shots fired. The forty three hundred block of South Sacramento. Three to four shots fired. Nothing seen by the caller. Zone thirteen, ninth district clear. Can you take a look at that? The shots fired on the 4300 block of Sacramento. Four, criminal trespass in progress, 2822 West Jackson, 2822 West Jackson at the at Deborah's place. Angelia says there's a female there who's been banned from the premises. Uh, she's a female black wearing a red hat, black jacket, striped orange shirt, and blue jeans. She's in the lobby now refusing to leave. Four thirty three twenty four. Let me know if you're ready. All right, All right it's a silver view with Lefebvre. It says it's been parked there for a month with a tarp over it. The address is sixty fifteen North Kalina, six zero one five Kalina. A vice complaint, 300 block in North Central Park, I had some time on it. People in a blue car waiting to buy drugs, the dealers come up to the vehicle. And this is called in by Anonymous. Okay. 
Thank you, Paul. Alright, there's a domestic battery call at 1800 West on Lawrence. It's at Mariano. The caller's in the parking lot. She's in a silver car. She wants her boyfriend out of the car. She stated that he kept hitting her. All City Envi Environmental Service to a Mark Minnan out of Willowbrook. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, Mr. Five from the City, we have a fire, 12435 South State, 12435 South State. Uh, call us there's a fire in the back of the what yard of the location. The fire is rolling, nothing further, zone 9, station clear. with the plate of Mary Adam Lincoln Ocean driving recklessly last seen headed eastbound on Irving Park. The station, there's some type of an order of protection and the caller is the one that the order of protection is on. She's on her way back home, so she should be there in about 5-10 minutes. 10-4, 14-22. Can you say that again? The call is left and one of the station. They should be uh, back towards the house um, at 1725 North Campbell in about five minutes. Type of order protection. Okay. Callers on the corner. Call that the petitioner, Bertha Cruz, is in 14. The respondent is going to be uh, her son and the girl that called. And they only speak Spanish. Uh, the offender is going to be a light-skinned uh, Latino guy with a ponytail. I like him. But uh, the victim is uh, struck in his uh, left thigh. Okay, he has, he has 
two gunshot wounds to his left leg. Um, he's saying that this was a robbery. Okay, so a GSW to the left leg, a robbery, count four. Uh, west through the gangway of 6440 North Campbell. 6440 North Campbell, westbound from that location to the gangway. Right here. I'm going off um, 320 North Damon, 320 North Damon, so the apartment 202 B is in boy. Radar door. Fifteen eighty four has an aggravated battery victim. He just wants photos at the hospital, no crime scene. The uh what kind of uh battery was shot at the gangway sixty four forty North Campbell. No Ohio with them. Thirty three Adams, Central Park in Ohio, Tut for. Clear from Kilmore. Uh, but this happened just in the last couple minutes. Uh, the description I already gave, just the one offender, uh, fled westbound uh, through the gangway. Send for you. Is EMS on scene yet? Got, uh, got the truck on yeah. scene, um, and I can hear the address pulling up shortly. What's his condition? He's, a, he's in a fair condition. He's uh, obviously agitated, but he's, he's speaking to me. He's going to feel good. Stop for us. 2023. 2023. Uh, 2023. Uh, 32. Stop for us. Three two coming in. Twenty two. Sitting in a dark colored SUV with the lights blinking since fifteen hundred hours. Nothing for. Twenty two. We had the first offender in custody. The first offender was in custody at 1612. I got the address. I don't know who this is. 1434. Okay. took place. I do have a a live round in the street. Uh, supposedly they shot at uh, unknown male shot at uh, 18 or 19 year old on a bike that fled eastbound from the uh, north alley or north gangway of 4345 on Sacramento. Okay, 10-4 on that. So there is a round at 4345 Sacramento in the street. Uh, the offender, unknown offender, shot at an 18 or 19 year old uh, who was on a bike. But he's not. The witnesses are saying uh, they were talking to the uh, the victim and it did not appear he was hit, did not went all the way around and he continued to uh, run. Ah. 10 for person shot at was not hit. The 18, 19 year old went east down and again he was on a bike. Doesn't appear he was hit. For the 14th of January, but that's 1913 feet. Um, the last job I saw there was a violation order protection on the 9th of January. Good thing. 
outside suspicious person at 4100 South Low. Uh, he was looking out the window, the caller was, and saw a male wearing a red jacket, black pants, creeping between the cars. Uh, he started walking eastbound. No further. Caller for animal abuse at 4617 home and about a dog being left outside if you can just code it in your travel. One one eight five nine. One one eight five nine. Two zero three five four. Two zero two four. Four five four. Um. Yeah, any of those here with with the system. Uh, but what I was able to get to uh, get from for now is that uh, two cell phones were taken an iPhone and uh, another phone. Okay, so for a cell phone. Kathy Center was taken. Uh, you would have to have turned uh, north and south in the West Valley of Campbell. There's no um, address uh, west there. So for we... Uh, gunshot wounds are going to be uh, groin and then uh, right uh, India Sibia and then maybe uh, a third to the left. So it's three GSWs. Say we pulled. That one's already approved. It's already done. There's no canceling it. Can't go back in time. Thank you, and 31. Hold on, I'm actually up. Property damage at Dangland Diversity, Dangland Diversity. Our barber's calling, there's two vehicles, no injuries, they're drivable, the other drivers refuse to exchange information. She's in the silver tow to Sienna versus a dark gray uh, Nissan Armada. That's why we have the number. It, you put one in error. So there's two RDs for the person shot. Four six five boys, you coming in? Four, could you put this on my box, please? It's going to be uh, CFD thirteen, Francis, and then uh, truck seventy one. Thirteen and seventy one, ten four. Four five four. Four five one. Squad neighbors say that the offender ran southbound in the West Alley towards Devon. Southbound West Alley of Devon, 10 4 for that offender. 2462. 462. I'm actually relocating the tag Francis with the victim. Latino, uh, ponytail, uh, approximately 5'9 to 5'11, and I'm sure you know. 5'9 to 5'11, medium bill, again with that ponytail. Four. Four, six, five, boys, you coming in? Four, six, five, boys, Is that 
Five foot nine to five foot eleven. He has a, a long ponytail and he's a uh, olive complexion. City right, we got a burglar in progress. Burglar in progress, 955 North Central. 955 North Central, we got details to follow. On an individual, someone, uh, they think that someone's kicking in a door on the side of the building, first floor. We got no further from now, 15 zone 12. Four seven five five. Four seven five five. Good evening, with you tonight. Good evening, sir. Someone that could check that location, 6433 North Washington. 62 David. 62 David, Sam. Okay, it's 
Floyd down over at 2349 West North, 2349 West North Floyd down, and one detained at 1821 hours, 42. 117 Go ahead, sir. Information on the uh, vehicle and the occupants of the, the, the vehicle. Sure, go ahead. Okay, so they're in a gray minivan. They're unknown what the model or make is. I have like the family stick figures on the back. It was occupied by two male Hispanics and their ages were like 20 to 30. So a gray minivan, unknown make of model, occupied two times male Hispanics, 20 to 30 years of age. Fourth plus. Okay, Tim. Okay. ID. member of 81 and squad, his last known address is in Oak Park. Got off the key on the citywide. You gotta keys. Yeah, that was open key. I, I didn't get any of that. Um, go to that again. Okay, squad. Subject's last name is David. David Adam Victor Ida Sam. First name Demetrius. David Eddie Mary. Eddie Tom Robert Ida Sam. Middle is D. David. He's a male black. He stands five foot five inches tall. 155 pounds. He has a DOB of 16 November 81. And he lays last laid his head um, in Oak Park slot. Marshall Alarm, 2700 West Roosevelt, 1133. Oak Park, clear. 10-4 squad, you got that um, ID number? Sure, it's uh, D. David, 120. 1648-1326. Uh, once again, that's ID David 120-1648-1326. Stand for thank you so much. Sir. on it. Second one says the heater is on fire inside the building on the first floor ramp. One two zero eight zero and off the floor. Uh, one two zero eight four. One two zero eight four. Six two zero. Four two zero. But uh, we're there. We had to talk to a couple people. They didn't. They said they didn't see anything, but uh, they're staying in the area. Looking. At. Four. Four, on, um, she cannot see what he has on. 3243 West Crystal. Okay. Ah. Ah. So, I made a threat to shoot up the school part of collar. One of the friends on the red hoodie, second one in the black jacket, and the third one in the red sweater. No weapon seen. In out of Illinois, I did get a valid Port ID response. The Daniel Nelson stays on Walcott out of Chicago, and that's all that's showing up for him. He's clear. And for Indiana, Nathaniel Jariah Nelson. And it's out of Gary, Indiana. I didn't copy. That's the one side of Indiana either, right?
to St. Francis, ambulance 13, relocated them. Say that, thank you. John Charlie 121940, John Charlie 121940, one event 11961, 11961. Adam Douglas, come for. Yeah, my box for 051 Adam. Alright, so it's going to be John Charlie 121942, 121942. Your event number is 11611, 11611. That's 3721 on Clark, 3721 Clark. So this is an intoxicated male at the doors of the Hotel Zachary. No Hispanic, black clothing, shouting at people, call the things he's a danger to people. No weapon seen. I'm not for sure. Okay, what's up? We'll show you clear. I'm 71. Report. Suspicious auto with occupants on the beat at 5100 South Loomis. Two female blacks. Um, a silver four-door sedan with a partial plate. Adam Mary threw a bottle at the caller's vehicle. No injuries. Refused the MS, of course. Vehicle lasting westbound on 51st Street. Like it's just a vehicle. Go ahead. This is Rosa, red four door with the child. 
child without a car seat female is texting. Location of 3630 on Clark. We're actually at the actual hotel. That's where this call is taking place, not 3721. Yeah, security already got folded. They walk us southbound on Lincoln, that's why. Odyssey minivan, about a 2000, heading northbound, I'm sorry, southbound on Sacramento from Archer. Okay, 10th we're on at 43-20-72 per O2SIM, a gray Honda Odyssey was seen prior to the incident. 2000 is a year, went southbound on Sacramento from Archer. Can you take a look at the burglar alarm? Three six pardon me, three eight three one Oakley, three eight three one Oakley on the one at the Singer residence. Slender a motion. Being on one person, nothing further. So Send for. Are you going to put a 014 atom on here? Correct. The four gangs are a uh, narcotic. Check. Uh, there is a, uh, a car that's holding the scene. Um, if they could, uh, for the sector, if you want to, you know, he arrives to take the shoals into the backyard. There's some, uh, this is some perspective. Okay, so for what unit is on scene over there on Campbell? Today. The neighbor's phone. I have nothing further. 7th District, zone 6. Fourteen twenty-three. 
either a blue jacket or blue shirt for the uh, Duke ticket. A uh, hoodie that covers the neck, the ears, no further. Uh, some cars on the north end of 47th Street, see if he's in the neighborhood. Some cars on the north end of 47th Street, see if he's in the neighborhood. Was there a female unit trying to come in? Yeah, 3-2, you can always down to one area. We're over here. Okay, 10-4. That's her house. Again, she's still on the phone with the call taker. Nineteen twenty three. Nineteen twenty three. Quick stop at thirty seven thirteen on We're okay. Three. Says uh, they need the police at Montrose Foods language barrier. Nothing prison. Can we get a personal in the uh, station? to fire, so they're not responding. Yeah, it's going to that thing. 6002, Ross Kenmore. On the map. them to walk up to our vehicle, we have the lights on. Ten 
a 28-year-old male white named Jacob Larson uh, left the hospital. He's in need of medical treatment. He's a male white, 5'8", 190 pounds, shirt uh, build. He's only wearing a t-shirt and shorts. He may suffer from mental illness and he's having hallucinations. He's currently walking westbound on diversity. on a suspicious vehicle, no occupants on Grace and Levitt. Two four. Eleven two four, we got voice now on the call back. We're at the Mrs. Red Lawrence Hall, 4833 North Francisco. Yes, Boy Charlie, 34652, that's coming back now. It's on a silver 2006 Infinity, Franklin Pope, out of Chicago.
I had 10 four banks, and um, I'm a, been over some reckless driving on the beach, and it was born really in the area of Glen Lake and Broadway. It does have some time. Sorry, we don't have any. Broadway and Glen Lake, uh, blue vehicle, Eddie 4349-88. We're driving reckless southbound on the bar. 9410, time was 1532. 22, you're stacking a suspicious auto with occupants on the beat. 4423 on Ketsy. Caller saying there's a male Hispanic about 25 to 30 years old. He's short, driving a black car. He followed her, um, and so she went into a business over there. Uh, he's parked a few doors up. She's at a piece of place. Her name is Maria. Casino 5. Casino 5. Yeah, we're clear. The uh, range is closed today. 10 4. 11 24, 10 4. Okay, who's moved them so that we can update the board in the event? Let's get 12, slow it down. That's Ohio Street Basement Apartment. High 2024 was. So 2005, I have you clear. Hello again, sorry. Uh, 
that power creates white smoke dragon with, with contemplate. Control five, we're over at home in the moment. Uh, negative, negative. Uh, I was just here uh, by my car and I was flagged by a citizen. I'm off duty. My partner is time on the end. I'll go take a look and see what I can see. 614. 1452. 1452. Criminal damage to property just occurred. Milwaukee and Fullerton. A mill white thing tagging the side of the building. She was seen jumping into someone's yard. Uh, he had on the face mask. House code, I'm guessing, is saying a bag in the back. Uh, Milwaukee and Fullerton. 10 1451, we'll ride with Who else is riding? 1451. Okay. And then 51, if you have a uh, PDT, if you can log in, please. for a DUI situation in the 17th district, please, and I need all set numbers. Progress. Female black is threatening a staff and individuals inside that location. Red skull cap, black jacket, red panties, and are outside of the clothing. 181 Thank you very much.
the 10 sectors down, any units that killed there in Ogden, south side of the Ogden scrapyard or the business is on fire. Forty-four, David. To thirty at Belmont and Broadway. Come for. Think even one two seven two five one two seven twenty five. Thank you. 24-12. 27th and Mustard. It's 
call just the carrier 2304 West Divine, 2304 Divine. A uh, vehicle driving behind the car was trying to hit his red Hyundai Elantra. It says the fender has a baseball bat trying to fight the caller. Alright, so I, it's confusing. I, I guess the offender is in the red Hyundai Elantra and the car is in the brown gray Honda Odyssey van. Um, pulled over, but it says that the offender is driving around in the area. Nothing further. Two four five one. Nineteen boy on there. Ten four. Twelve thirty one. Just send out the watch squad. Uh, Taylor Lapwood. Ten four. It'll be in your box. Now two. We get a 30th piece, please. Jump for it, very much. Jump for it. 20, 30. 30. Swedish hospitals call in. They had a trans uh, patient transported to them from the brown line on Kimball, but the patient left her, her wheelchair behind, and they're asking if we can grab the wheelchair and bring it to Swedish Hospital. And that brown line's in the 17th district. So, what do you want me to do at this point? The 170 boy for that shot spotter on Christianity gives slow down. We got a couple units looking around. Don't they have a wheelchair she could use at the hospital? I guess she does, but it's her, the electric wheelchair belongs to the patient. I guess they didn't want it left at the brown line. All right. Um, I guess send the wagon over, see if they can get a bit in the wagon. I don't know if they can take it. Careful, thanks. 2071. You know what? 71. Stop, 4558 North Allison, Indiana. Uh, 2030, correction. They want the patient picked up from Swedish and taken to her wheelchair at the Brown Line on Kimball.
Donietta, David Ocean, Nora Young, Victor, Adam, Henry, Ida, Adam, last name, Norman, King, Ida, Nora, Eddie, Robert, Mary, Ocean, Nora, middle initial, Lincoln. Phone number 773-512-8054. Uh, John Charlie, one two one nine eight eight. Okay, that's why I have the request. You can switch back. Thank you. Chad, Division of Winchester. Division of Winchester, ten four. We're not going to take the liability of transporting somebody back to their wheelchair, and this should be the hospital's responsibility to arrange transfer for her to go to her wheelchair. I 100% agree with that, or, or they could try to call 17. No, we're going to call it at 19 Paul on our end, okay?